Greetings Toy Table fans, we are trackside for the fourth qualification race of the Chair and a Dream Hot Wheels Sprint Championship. Let's remind our newer viewers of, the, of our, our, our first three qualifiers that are already in the sandwich bag of uh, safety. And they are off to the finals. The first one is the 57 Chevy Blue. On day two, the Nissan Skyline took it down. And on day three, yesterday, the blue Corvette made it into the sandwich bag of safety. We have eight new, new competitors. One will get in, one will earn a spot into the sandwich bag of safety and avoid going into Ken's general population of cars. Uh, we'd like, I'd like to thank everybody that uh, has watched this series and has uh, picked cars. It makes it a whole lot more fun during the car introduction. Without further ado, let's meet our new racers. We have a red bucket of, uh, to randomize the uh, our matchup randomizer. First off, we have the Bone Speeder, favored by Hot Wheel or HW Road Beasts. Sorry about yesterday's race. He picked the fig rig, and I totally messed up that race. Second, Golden Arrow. He's, they're favored by Family Fun and Toys. The 17 Bagani, it was cut off short in yesterday's video, so no one really had a chance to pick him. But he's in, the, in this matchup as well. The 41 Willis Custom Hot Wheels team. He's favored by uh, Hot Wheels Calgary. Then, we have we had two, uh, two sponsorships. Uh, the 57 Chevy. Thunderground Racing and Chris Cage 2 time or 2x each favor this 57 Chevy. Sixth, we have uh, the Side Drifter, which remain unclaimed. Then seventh, we have the Ford GT Racer 2016, unclaimed as well. And eighth into the bucket is the Lamborghini Countach which also remained unclaimed. Be sure guys to stick around to the end of the video or skip there and pick tomorrow's, uh, tomorrow's set of cars. Without further ado, let's give these a shuffle and let's make up our matchups. In the first matchup today, we're gonna have the 41 Willis. Which is gonna be racing Side Drifter. The second matchup is going to be the 4 GT Racer versus the 57 Chevy. Then the 17 Pagani is going to lead off in the third heat versus the Countach. And in the fourth and final heat we have HW Road Beast Boat Speeder versus Family Fun and Toys Golden Arrow. Without further ado, let's get this race started. There we have our first two uh, racers ready to go. Let's just take a quick look at the track for our new viewers. It's just a simple six lane. Going to go two lengths of track before they hit the gate and into the wall of bounty of, or the bounty wall of safety. All right, 41 Willis. Hot Wheels Calgary's paying attention. One, two, three, race. Oh no. Side Drifter took out the 41 Willis. Side Drifter moves into the fourth round final or semi final. Next up, get the 57 Chevy versus Ford GT Race Racer. One, two, three, race. Good start, 57 Chevy, edges out the Ford, set up our first semi-final, let's get these two up, up top, okay so our first semi-final has been set up here in the fourth qualifier, 17 Pagani versus the Lamborghini Countach, Mr. Main Unclaimed, 17 Pagani just 
beats the Countach by a nose and crashes into the Ford GT. Okay, there he is, first semifinal there, all vying for a little picture in the Hot Wheels Flame of Stage. I don't know. Okay, Bone Speeder, Golden Arrow, you're up next. Semifinals on the lane or on, on the line. Single elimination. One, two, three, race. Bone Speeder takes that one handily. Close race though. Not much room for air. You really have to have a good start on this short course. Okay, here's our two semifinalists. Or our four semifinalists. Let's get these to the top of the hill. Okay. First semifinals all set up. Can we get two 57 Chevys into the sandwich bag of safety? One, two, three, race. No. Side Drifter takes it. Okay. We've got the 17 Pagani versus HW Road Beast Bone Speeder. Chance for the finals. Go against the side drifter. One, two, three, race. Bone speeder. Winner. Beats Pagani. out the Pagani. Going to face the side drifter in the finals. Let's get him cleaned up and to the top of the hill. Okay, here's our final. Bone speeder versus side drift. Beat out all the license, each, all the license cars. Here we go. One, two, three, race. Side Drifter takes it easily. There you have it, folks. Side Drifter going for his cover shot here. Woo! Off to the sandwich bag of safety. Anyways, guys, thanks again for watching Toy Table Racing. It's been a whole lot of fun setting up this series. I should have links in the description to get to the first three uh, qualifiers, speed limit 55 miles per hour. Don't think we did that today. Just a reminder, tune in Saturday and oh yeah, we must uh, look at tomorrow's cars. Let me get them set up for Saturday's cars. Hang tight folks. <laughs> well after that sign off we remembered we still had business to do. That was a very close race. Side Drifter took it down. Bone Speeder. Sorry, buddy. Anyways, let's take a look at uh, tomorrow's racers. Be sure to cast your votes. You got two days to vote. I'll go through the comments and uh, put together a, a nice race. So, first, we have the 67 GTO Pontiac. Then, we have the red version of the six of the 2016 GT Ford Racer. We got some good cars for uh, qualifier number five for the Chair and a Dream downhill sprint. No, that's not what it is. <laughs> the the Chair Toy Table Racing's Chair in a Dream Hot Wheels downhill sprint. Next time, much easier name. Just trying to be funny with it. Spectre. Going up, going tomorrow. Then we have a Torque Twister, red version. Cool car. What I suspect might be a crowd favorite. We have a station wagon. This one's not so new, but it still performs pretty well. That could be my pick. Then we have a 412 Mustang Boss. Ken hasn't destroyed that one too much. Pretty new car here too. You got the Barbie Corvette. Probably another favorite. We have a 64 Impala. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to uh, cast your vote and we'll get you into the next race. Thanks, thanks again for watching the Toy Table and Toy Table Racing. Anyways guys, keep collecting and keep on racing.